Hello everybody and welcome to the second part in SOLIDWORKS to make uh, a chair let's start our second part uh, you can just choose the top plane and it's the same method we did in the first and make a relation we're using that and add the fillet here with 50 okay and make a construction convert the construction uh, choose the front plan where is he make it 20 here use the swept choose this circle and the second choose this one and uh, make a material like this one uh, the second thing choose the top plan oh no it's not so nice we have Two millimeter here and two here and forty five degrees and from here thirteen hundred eighty if you can't uh, click in this edge you can use uh, from here to here make 148.5 I think it's the same thing okay uh, go to feature evolved code select this axis like curve and uh, add the fillet with one millimeter here and use mirror to mirror all this choose the right the fillet is selected it's just add this one geometry pattern click ok and we have same thing in this direction now go to shell with one millimeter select these faces click ok and use a cut in this face with three millimeter okay extrude through all click ok And we have finished this part. Now, save it. I uh, forgot to tell you uh, in the last uh, episode to save your file. Uh, here, for example, I will create a new folder. Uh, that's the part two, okay? But you have to, to save uh, this one in uh, in the same folder part one okay and uh, let's go ahead and start the second uh, the third part okay uh, select the front and just sketch something like that 
but this one have to be horizontal and add this dimension we have 150 here and 110 here we have 30 here 15 from here to here 15 okay and add a fillet here with 10 and 6 here okay and uh, use the center line to add mirror select all these with click and drag and click mirror entity and go now go to sheet metal make three here in a sheet metal parameter and and the direction one put 20 okay and now go to sample hole click here and the diameter is uh, I think 3 yes 3 here and click OK now go to sketch of the hole and we have to reposition all this to so just make a center line here select uh, this point and this uh, edge and uh, make midpoint then add the uh, circle here put um, 90 and make a relation with this center make horizontal and this this uh, circle and this make equals okay and select this um, center line and this circle using the control uh, key in your keyboard of course and uh, mirror entities now it should just validate and you have the whole year and uh, now you have just to create uh, a plan with uh, 55 select this mirror edges go to sketch start for example from here and finish the scale and finish the sketch and uh, make this as construction make here 175 here 170 here we have 25 and here we have 45 okay And uh, the last thing this one we we put it where hmm. You can just add the relation with this one and this point. Uh, make middle, okay. Now use a sketch fillet with uh, with what with five, okay. 
and uh, validate the sketch and go to this surface sketch use uh, this one start from this and just delete all this and put geometry here we have seven from this point from this point to this we have ten okay and uh, from from this one and this point where is it oh no I can't see from here to here we have one millimeter and use the spline from here to here and escape use this one to this relation make tangent and click in uh, this parameter make horizontal okay and you can just use the center line again to select all mirror entities okay validate your sketch and you go to surface now we will use all the, the feature of SolidWorks uh, use what? A swept uh, surface select this and uh, for the path use this path click OK and uh, just use the, the thickness okay thicken select this face use uh, thicken side one it's just with one click OK and uh, mirror go to mirror feature mirror and uh, choose the plan it's not this one but the right and click in this feature click OK and geometry pattern again what we have what's the problem geometry pattern feature scope mm, I think because of of the thicken I think click OK and now go to mirror use the right plan the feature is is this one feature I click OK geometry pattern okay it's just uh, you have to switch if you have a problem here, so the side one or the side two, it's not a problem. This and uh, the last thing to do is uh, selecting this and from here add the dimension with twenty here and 180 make uh, oh no, okay make a uh, vertical and uh, now can just suppress this 
and use uh, tangent arc and add a circle here with 3 millimeter if I remember okay and uh, use a center line to make to make all this mirror then uh, go to surface plan a surface and click OK now it should just use thicken switch with one millimeter click OK the same thing here OK and uh, the last is to add the fillet here with 8 it's not this the same thing in this side validate and add the hole here with 4 and we have five from here and the ten from here. We can use extruded cut and through all and we have finished our part. It's just to add a loy. Okay. Save your part with part three and uh, put uh, save and you can hide this okay and if you like it you can just uh, subscribe and uh, leave a comment if you have any question i uh, thank you for watching see you next tutorial